Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to the Dumb Launch Play, Pokemon Fire Red Nuzlocke. I'm Windmill Zaggard. I'm Miniature Golf Christine. I'm Holin One Andrew. <laughs> we were talking about mini golf off screen, and as I now realize, that has nothing to do with Pokemon. <laughs> so I don't know why we used those introductions. I, I wanted to say, hey, oh no, but I didn't. <laughs> Anyways, yeah, just... all the things that they, the audience would understand. <laughs> uh, we suck. And I didn't switch out, so this could be a problem. Well, uh, you're faster than him. No, we're dead. Uh, oh, okay. you're, you're fine. Kill we're alive! Kill him, you're faster. Oh. Okay. Miss. I know it That's didn't. what I'm worried about. I know it didn't because it showed the animation, but it would have been hilarious. Well, it would have been sad. Well, you could do it like the Z move where it just shows the starting animation and then missed. Okay, then. I haven't played any of Moon except for half of the first island. Hmm. And so I don't I still haven't beaten Moon. I've been too busy to play it. I'm, I'm literally at the champion. No, you are. Yeah, he's he's hard. I'm uh, not gonna give it a, give away who it is, even though it's obvious, really. It's always obvious. Yeah. That's ah! what every changes in Pokemon. Nessie! Oh, Nessie's getting some XP. <laughs> she sucks. We always not a shell. Back on Why do you suck? Well, she's well also... this is what happens when you change her origins from Scotland to Alabama. <laughs> no, we didn't change her origins. She. Oregon. She's always been She's, What are you, Marvel? Just changing everything? <laughs> no. <laughs> we're not changing her origin. She's always been from Alabama. Her famous cousin is from Scotland. Look, she's not Scarlet Witch and Quicksilver. You can't just suddenly decide you want her to come from a completely different thing. <laughs> that, that's true. <laughs> okay, well, fair enough. Ah! Actually, wait, yes I can. Because the Loch Ness Monster is a mystical creature, and Scarlet Witch is a mystical person, and Nessie Quick is our slave, and we can do whatever we want with her backstory. Okay. But remember, she's always been from Alabama. She's just her famous cousin is from Scotland. Oh, this was Seismic Toss. It would have gone second. Or, no, wait, that's Final Throne. Never mind. Alright, I'm not... Why is everybody it's dying? Like, just switch just attack, just, just attack. Yeah, but he, I think he's slower. It's Hitmon... It's Master Wayne, isn't he fast? He's slow as hell. Then why did you send him out in the first place? Never mind, he's, he's fast. not slow at all. <laughs> he's the leg guy! He's gotta be fast! <laughs> Yeah, it'd be kind of weird if he was to sell him. So, yeah. And on top of that, he's Batman. <laughs> no, he's Mr. Wayne. Roadhouse. He just happens to know <laughs> Batman. Everybody's getting Mr. Stopped. Wayne did not skip leg day. I'm sure I've yeah. made that joke before. Mm -hmm. um, I mean, it's true even if it wasn't a joke. Everybody's One thing dying. I did like in BVS was the training scene. With uh, with Batman showing how he trained. All the Batman scenes were pretty good. Yeah, like I said, just make a Batman movie, Zach. <laughs> uh, actually, you, you would have made a great Batman film, honestly. Mm, <laughs> but, uh, true. <laughs> if you had done the weird thing is he tried. It was supposed to be a Batman and Superman movie, and then it became well. I mean, okay, I think we've already discussed. Yeah, this. we knew, we knew weeks ago. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It, yeah. Well, let's let's talk about something new. Kingdom Hearts 2.8 is going to come out in five oh, days. Oh yeah, it's almost out. And I would like to apologize, guys. We were trying to get through all the Kingdom Hearts games before 2.8 came out. That's clearly not going to happen. What do you mean? We can finish everything in like five days? Yes, we can finish the rest of Kingdom Hearts Reaching of Memories. All of Kingdom Hearts 2. Of all three, all four stories, no wait, five stories of Kingdom Hearts Birth by Asleep. And then be ready for 2.0. Okay, guys, I think a more realistic goal that puts a lot less stress on us is to get them all done before 3 comes out. Yeah, okay. Yeah. So what are you looking forward to more? Dream Drop Distance in HD, 2. Uh, 0. 0.2 a Fragmented Passage, or, or the film, the 80-minute um, film, yes. Well, I've already played Dream Drop Distance, but I actually really am thrilled that I'm going to get to play it in HD. Um, 
And on a console, one thing I didn't like about Dream Drop Distance was the touchscreen stuff. They still have it, but it's not. But as... it, 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 is it like with the PS4 touchpad? Um, probably. Because no. I don't see how the hell. Else I can show you a video where somebody talks about it if you don't mind. Uh, well, I guess I'll just find out. But, uh, um, it's it's well okay if you don't well, okay well okay so that's. Still in. Okay. It's, it's, okay, it's not as bad as using touch screen, let me just say that. That is... I'm glad to hear that. I don't like touch screens. I'm sorry, I don't. I like them. Uh, I think they're fun for some things, but for the most part, they're pretty gimmicky. Yeah. There's my problem with them. And I when know, you just pointlessly for... throw them into a game, which is part of a franchise guess... that has never had this, like uh, Uncharted for the PS Vita, oh, yeah. or um, or like Kingdom Hearts. <laughs> I think it's because I like RPG, so just tapping. Well, in an attacks, RPG, it's not a problem at all. Strategy games. But in a real-time fighter, where suddenly yeah. you got to use the touch screen, it's a bit annoying. <laughs> no, that I can understand. I I liked RPGs, I... and uh, I like. Strategy yeah. games, like yeah, so. like I just said, that that is no problem in an RPG because you got all the time in the world. Just <laughs> just sit back and touch the screen. That's fun. But um, but yeah, in other stuff, I don't really like it that much. And that that was one issue with the PS Vita is they made like um they made a lot of the buttons just uh, parts of the touch screen, and they didn't tell you which parts. It was annoying. That. That, yeah, that's pretty cool. Like, you remember playing the Jack and Daxter oh, trilogy yeah. on the Vita and how we had to figure out which part was supposed to be R2 and which part was supposed to be L2? Ended up looking it up repeatedly. <laughs> yeah, that was like... Because the game just says press the touch screen and it doesn't tell you a specific part and I ended up accidentally doing all this crazy shit. And then the funny <laughs> thing is you actually end up... Get, like, we were trying to do uh, Jack and Daxter, the board challenges to get points and... You usually have to do a bunch of tricks, and he accidentally ended up doing, like, four tricks while standing still, just jumping and doing them all. It was so weird. I wish we had caught that on camera or something. Yeah, it was just, like, him doing all these tricks, and it's like, wait, what the heck? What is this? Yeah, How did it, it was the weirdest jet board trick we've ever done. <laughs> and it was, and we were just like, can we recreate it? And we kept recreating it. I mean, like, it. this would be great in those challenges where you have to rack up yeah, the it points. Yeah, it was hilarious. Uh yeah. <coughs> oh, this sucks. We're so terrible trainers. Yeah. And my grammar is Speak terrible for too. Yourself. You can't even talk. Now, why don't you get into that fecal position? <laughs> Again. Hey, it keeps coming up. Okay. Um. Another thing coming out soon, the Switch... Well, I mean, I say soon, but it's another two months. Yeah, um, uh, the Switch and Breath of the Wild, which you talked in the last episode, but the thing I am really looking forward to is Mass Effect Andromeda, which we will be playing as soon as we can. I want to play that as close to the release date as possible, because I have been looking forward to that game for forever. And then, of course, we have to play Breath of the Wild when it comes out, because... Of course. Well, yeah, but I've been looking forward to <clears throat> Mass Effect and Andromeda. Yeah. Or Here, Ed each of us Third. are going to mark a game, which we will most definitely play when it comes out. Zagard has marked Andromeda. We will play it right when it comes out. Christine has marked Breath of the Wild. Mine, Red Dead Redemption 2. Hmm. Have they, they've announced that. They did. Have yeah, they? they did. That's why. Yeah, they did. That's yeah. why I'm marking it. And it's at and least another year or two off. It's uh, at the earliest, at the very earliest, going to come out next fall. Um, which which was their plan when they announced it? But we all know that never really 2018 happened. Twenty eighteen fall, twenty seventeen. Twenty seventeen fall. Yeah, that's yeah. It'll be that was that was their spring that was their original announcement. But games get delayed all the damn time. So here. spring twenty eighteen. Yeah, of course. I do want to this coming summer if we can. I do want to play through Red Dead during the summer. <laughs> if we can, yeah. If we can. If Mass Effect comes out in April, right? May. May. Okay, well, we'll play through that first. It comes out, like, right around the time Breath of the Wild comes out. Alright, so we'll probably... We might be playing... Those might be the two games we're playing yeah. at yeah, the okay. time. And then when we finish one of them, I'd like to start Red Dead. Uh... We can talk about this later. Okay, so, yeah. okay. I mean, if anyone yeah! wants to weigh in, go ahead. Yeah, in the comments, <laughs> yeah. all you people who haven't been commenting. All fucking four of you who still watch us. <laughs> We still have eight subscribers, yeah. 
Yeah, and some of our views have gone up. Oh, God, so. we haven't lost any. Um, <laughs> yeah, because, I, and we are thankful for that because we know that we haven't kept up with the schedule. That is mainly my fault. I apologize. It's been my work schedule on top of losing my voice. It's been crazy. I'd say it's a mix of all our faults. I yeah, know. but I, I take most responsibility. It is my work schedule. I work five days a week, so that's the main issue. Uh -huh. I mean, it's not like we really get paid to do this, so... <laughs> yeah, I know, but I enjoy doing it, and I feel bad when I'm the reason we can't do it. So, sh sh shameless self-promotion coming up, just, can you share with people? We want more people to watch it. <laughs> <laughs> that voice! <laughs> you, you just do it, guys! It's like, like, I'm not saying, we're not saying, like, force the whole series on someone, but if there's one episode that you think is particularly funny, go ahead and show someone and see what happens. Roll out! Or all the episodes, that would, that would be nice, too. Do we want roll out? Uh, it's kind of a death trap, but it's yeah, also... Yeah, that's, I was about to say, it's kind of a death I, I, trap. I, I if we get stuck, we might die. But I like... I do like it to get stronger every No, no, time. I like our set already, because Body Slam is... Yeah, I, here's the thing... The well, only thing yawn. I kinda want to get rid of is rest. Well, rest is helpful, especially in a Nuzlocke. But you I know, use but yawn. like, if also well, going to sleep thing. puts you in a trap. I mean, wouldn't it be better to just use a hyper potion? True. I mean, if we still had snore or sleep talk, but if we run out, rest. like say at the uh, Elite Four, then we might. But then again, it. we do have a Poke flute, so that's one reason to keep it. Eight. And and Slimlax is a tank, so. Actually, yeah, when I really think about it, rest isn't a bad thing. Um, we haven't I, used Yawn a lot. Well, we're what if we're like, up against some fucking asshole Pokemon and we want to put it to sleep? I'm sure someone has hypnosis. Like, oh, um, uh, Mr. Sandman will learn hypnosis. Okay, then we can just get, get rid of the, uh, the only problem. I'm is gonna call him Mr. Sandman, I don't give a The fuck. only problem <laughs> is that if we do get stuck, then we're stuck. And we're stuck doing it for five turns. That is the thing I worry about. But, you know, the rollout would probably be useful against the Ice Elite Four member. Well, we already have Mr. Wayne for that. Yeah, that is true. He's not we very do. strong. What Look, do you, mean? you remember his defense is not very good. Yeah, but he's going to But his attack the, is good. His attack is good, and they're weak against And him. he's fast. He's going to get the first hit, and he's going to hit with a lot of power. That's so he'll. he'll I'm he'll counting either. on him to cut to one shot at least two of that bitch's Pokemon. Yeah. Same. Uh, and you can also kick uh, Bruno's uh, Onyx's asses. Or does Bruno have Ghost Onyx's so on the first is go? Is Ghost I think he so double effective, effective on Ghost in this skin? What is? Ghost is Ghost, Ghost doubly effective against Ghost? I. Because I remember so. it was first, like first, first gen. It was, but I don't know. If it I think that it way. still is. Okay, so we can't get rid of Shadow Ball because it's immune no. to Ghost. You and... you keep Shadow Ball, you keep Body Slam. Yeah. Um, if you really want to get rid of Yawn, I'm fine with it. Just... I'm I'm not a, I don't object because of Hypnosis. Like you said. yeah. The, the only the only I... the only problem is Hypnosis is doesn't hit easily. Yeah, it has low accuracy. And Yawn always fucking hits, <laughs> even though it does take up two turns instead of one. Yeah, that's the trade off. Um, so uh, you decide. You decide. Me? No, Christine. Oh yeah, Christine. Okay. Eh, let's get rid of yawning. Okay. All right. Just because, in case we absolutely need it, like we're at a loss, and then we just know we're dying, and we have to do something stupid. You know, it still bugs me from time to time the fact that we didn't beat Sephiroth. <laughs> <laughs> he just stays up late at night going, Sephiroth. I I wish. Look, I knew we weren't going to make the Ultima Weapon. I stated that from the very beginning of the game, remember? Yes, <laughs> I remember. But other than that, beating Sephiroth is the one thing we didn't do. <laughs> well, I don't think we're... When we get to Kingdom Hearts 2, I don't think we're going to beat Lingering Will, so... Yeah, you got a point there. <laughs> to be fair, though, I've never beaten Lingering Will. I have beaten Sephiroth in Game 1. And that's why I say we're never... God, you remember when I beat Unknown? God, that was... Yeah, it was on your third try, you were like, I took so close, and then you killed him, and you were just... Yeah, that was... yeah and I'm, I'm glad, like, I partially thank you, too, because you were the one who said, you know, on, on Unknown, we should have three tries instead of two. Because <laughs> it was a story yeah. thing. It felt like it made sense. Yeah. Um, 
It's funny, because up until Sephiroth, I was beating everyone in one try. <laughs> Remember, I just yeah. tore right through Kurt Z's of Phantom and Ice Titan. And then suddenly Sephiroth kicks all of our asses. Yeah, so I know who you are! You're Mr. Wayne! And he also he identified Mr. Wayne, which means the secret out is out. He's no longer able to pretend he's not Batman. It was so random. <laughs> um, <laughs> well, no, the guy just identified him. I know, it's just weird, because we were just talking about Sephiroth. Like, I know who you are! You're Mr. Wayne! <laughs> well, the episode will now be Batman Exposed. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, just show, just show like detect. No! Nah! Okay, I'm, okay, we're faster, scared. but I don't want to risk it. Who says? What do we do? I'm not taking any of the blame for this. <laughs> I'm just gonna kill him and then go Slimlax when the next Pokemon comes. If cause... you want to risk it. Well, I don't want Slimlax to take any extra damage. Is I'm it? not taking any of the blame for this. See, this is what happens when you out. Okay. Anyway, <laughs> this is what happens when you out his. Uh, his identity. Yeah, yeah, he becomes vulnerable. Like, and uh, like the thumbnail just have Detective Machop like exposing Mister. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, which Bruce Wayne should I use? All of them. Uh, He's every single Bruce Wayne. Whichever one you can find a good image for. Uh, He's all of the Bruce Waynes. Ben How Affleck. are you going to merge animated with live action? Very scarily. <laughs> and that's like it is. Yeah. Speaking of which, I have something to uh, tell you about later that I think Christine will enjoy. Yes! He's dead! That was rude. I don't care! <laughs> I'm celebrating the death of the macho oh, that we've been beating mercilessly for the past half hour. What about the time you paralyzed that <laughs> oh, <yeah. laughs> The poor bastard! I've just been mercilessly going after him. I'm like a schoolyard bully. Mercilessly in the fecal position. <laughs> <laughs> Excuse me, I'm sorry. Every time someone says a word wrong, I'm going to bring up the fecal position. Well, I guess <laughs> we can be sorry about the fecal position in the next episode of the Dumb Lawns Play. Pokemon Fire Red Nuzlocke. Hey everyone, it's Zaggard here. And that was a pretty interesting episode. Sorry for all the grinding. Don't worry, I will do some grinding off screen, and the next episode should be us doing something interesting. And if you hope that is the true, click that like button, click that subscribe button to see that in the future, and I'll see you in the comments.